ready to start a new class, a new day, a new class. Today we are going to be working with the simple past tense. Yes, no questions, uh, working with regular and irregular verbs. So let's just wait for everybody to jump in so we can start with our class as soon as possible. time. Roxana, good evening. How are you? Good evening, teacher. I'm great. Nice, and nice. Well, let me see. A new day, being busy, working. And how was your day? What about you? How was your day? Tell me. This, this day, is, it was busy too. And I, I had a lot of work. Oh, really? What did you do today? What did you do today, Roxana? Um, Tell me. Some activities, check emails and emails, and create reports, and I am... System manager. Oh, you are the system manager. So you have a lot of responsibilities. Yes. Okay. That means that you are busy all the time. Yes, always. <laughs> I can imagine. I can imagine. That's the way it is. That's the way. It, I mean, that's what we do in our job. Many different activities and according to the, I mean, According to the position, there increases the level of responsibilities. So that means that you have more responsibilities. Yes, uh, yeah, more. Uh, I need to do a lot of things on time. Oh, I can imagine. But uh, how long have you been in that company? How many um, years? Nine years. Nine years already? Wow, it's been long. It's been a while. Yes, it's a long time. Yeah, I mean, it's a long time. That's good because it means that uh, it means stability. And that's something hard nowadays. 
Do you know that word nowadays? No, I don't. Okay, that word nowadays means hoy en día. And the pronunciation is mm. nowadays. Nowadays. Yes. Oh, okay. nowadays. Stability, I mean, job stability nowadays, it's hard. Yes, uh, all, all uh, companies, uh, how do you say, record on personal? They let go personal? They let go personal and we have more work. Yes, of course. Mm -hmm. yeah, that's, that happens and I mean, it's, it's hard for everybody. Yes, yes. Only um, they said uh, a new activity for you. They just assign res more responsibilities. Yes. I assign me new responsibilities. Yes. Okay. Hey, look, there's Vicky. Thank you, Roxana. Good evening, teacher. Good evening, Vicky. How are you? Tell me. Fine, thanks. How was your day? Um, a hard day. Oh, really? You had yes. a hard day? What did you do today? Um, in meetings. Okay. I was in meetings. I had meetings. I have meetings all day. Okay. What else did you do? Um, presentation. Okay. For new project. Oh, nice. Mm -hmm. So you've been preparing all the information for the presentation today. Yes. Okay. That's quite interesting. You're yes. very busy. Yes. Uh, I was talking to Roxana exactly that, that nowadays, I mean, in, your, in our jobs, they assign more and more and more responsibilities and we have to work a lot and fast. Well, thank you, Vicky. Angelica, thank you, good teacher. evening. Hello, Angelica, can you hear me? Hello, teacher. How are you, Angelica? I am, f I am fine, thank you. Okay, how was your day, Angelica? Tell me. Uh, I, that what? Repeat the question. How was your day? Uh, relapse, relapse. I, Today, I do exercise. I did. What? I did. Ah, pardon. I did exercise. Ah, okay. Or you can ah? say, another way you can say is, I exercise. Exercises. I did exercises. Okay, good, good, excellent. You can also say, I Exercise. Exercise is a verb also. Uh -huh. so you Exer can say, exercises. No with S at the end. No con S al final. With a exercise. D. Okay, okay, perfect. Remember, it's with a D at the end. Okay? okay. Perfect. Thank you, Angelica. You're welcome. Francisco, good evening. How are you? Good evening, teacher. How are you? I'm fine. I'm fine. I was worried that you were not connected. What happened? Tell me. Yes, I'm sorry. Uh, I'm very late. Sorry? Late? Late, yes. Uh, I'm very late. Sorry. You had a lot of work today? Yes, it's a very hard this day. Oh, really? Tell me why. What did you do today? Uh, first, the rain. 
is very difficult for the project. Oh, it has rain in San Salvador? No, in, in, in Santa Ana. In Santa Ana, yeah, that's right, you work in Santa Ana. Yes. Been yes. raining over there? Yes, all day rain. Oh, really? Yes, uh, for this case, uh, people... Um, they cannot work. Yes, because um, it's, it's for you, for here, healthy. Uh, actually, safety? Yes, it's for, for your health. No. No, for their, their, for their, 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 yes. for their health. For their health. And yes. safety, I imagine. Salud y seguridad. Correct. Correct. That's and safety and healthy. Okay. Safety and health. Healthy. I'm sorry. Safety and health. health. Look at the chat. Safety and health. For their safety and health. Safety so, and health for the people. Yes. Okay, uh, but the uh, work in the office uh, is very hard because uh, many many reports. Many reports. Yes, many reports. Okay, okay. Uh, well, that's the way it is. Thank you, Francisco. Yes, okay, teacher. Hilda, good evening. Good evening, teacher. How elegant you look today, Elda. Oh, yes. I work to all day. <laughs> oh, really? So today no exercising? No, today no. Uh, until tomorrow. Okay. What did you do today? Uh, I work in the office. I work? I think uh, many uh, employees. 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 Uh, and the many, many documents. Documents. Yeah, documents and, and meet, and meet presen presencial, meet. And meetings, or meetings. meetings. You meetings. can say meetings. Yes, uh, yes. Okay, mm -hmm. well, that's very interesting. So you had a very busy day today. Yes, very busy. Yeah. Almost everybody's done. Yes. Or, or, excuse me? No, tell me, please. Okay. Very busy, but I'm tired, but I always say, happy, but be happy. Okay. <laughs> I try, I try be happy all time. I try to be happy. I try to be happy all time. That's good. Yes. That's good. That's a good attitude. Yes, positive attitude. Uh, it time. helps a lot. It really helps. Thank yes. you, Hilda. Okay. Sylvia, hello. Good evening. Good evening, teacher. How are you, Sylvia? Uh, uh, fine. Fine. I'm um, very, um, no, no, a little tired. A little tired? Uh, Why? I, I, uh, I am uh, six a.m. on um, um, my work. You arrived at six a.m. to your work, and yeah. at what time did you finish working? I uh, finished working um four p.m. Oh, it's been a long day for you. Yeah. And then you were working in the platform, right? Uh, <laughs> yes. That's good, that's good. Remember, for the platform, guys, just eight more days to finish. Yes. Mm -hmm. Okay, let's see. Somebody is sick and is not connecting, but I don't know who's that. I don't have the names with the number. Oh, Janari. She has a headache, the flu, and feels death. Wow, she's sick. She can not be able to be in the class. Okay. So guys, today we are going to work with simple past again. 
remember that the first day we were working with the regular verbs, we were talking about the pronunciation of the regular verbs, the simple past, the ending ed, how to pronounce it. And yesterday we were working with something a little bit different because we work with the structuring of the sentences. Remember that the, for the affirmative sentences, we use uh, the subject plus the base, the verb in past, and then the complement. For the negative form, we use the subject plus the auxiliary. And the auxiliary for the simple past is did, which is the past of the verb do. But here is working as an auxiliary. After did comes not, and then comes the main verb, but in the base form. Or something that could be easier for you to understand, in present. So we have subject, did, not, verb in present, complement. Simple. In the interrogative form, what happens is that the, the auxiliary did goes at the beginning. And then the structure is auxiliary, subject, verb in present, complement, and question mark. Always remember for questions, the question mark. But before we continue to the next activity, hello, Vanessa, good evening. Hello, teacher, good evening. How are you? Um, I am tired. Tired? Everybody's like that today. Tell me, what did you do today, Vanessa? Um, I terrible day. Oh, really? Because, Why? Because um, problem with um, uh, I I I no sé cómo decir entre el personal. Um, oh, the employees. Yes. And uh, the result is difficult. Talk with one person, one other person. Yeah. Eso como de buscar culpable. <laughs> yeah, that's hard. That's hard. Yes, yes. I that's... come back. Uh, así se dice. I Green. came back. I came back at 7.30. Oh, my uh, gosh. Uh, very, oh, very late. You just yes. arrived. Yes, yes. I este, um, uh, eat sandwichito. <laughs> I, and then I, con, I just had I will, a sandwich. I just had a sandwich. I just had a sandwich and then connect. Connect to the, the class. class. Okay. Yes. No, don't worry, this is going to be short. It's just an hour. Then you can relax, forget a little yes. bit about the job everyday job yes well it's good to have you here in class and thank you teacher you're welcome today we are going to work uh, well actually we are going to work with two different things we're going to be making uh, sentences in affirmative negative interrogative and we are going to be using yes no questions in simple past what is that like uh, Vanessa tell me uh, did you have lunch today? Yes. Yes, I did. I did. Yes, I did. Okay. As uh, with the present, when we say short answers, we say in, uh, mm -hmm. in present is yes, I do. In past is mm -hmm. yes, I did. For negative, no, I don't. In present, no, I didn't. Okay. Mm -hmm. The okay. only difference is that for the past is very, very simple. Let me show you something, guys. Okay, let's see. When we talk about the past, eh, well, when we talk about the present, do you remember we say, we said, yes, I do, or no, I 
don't. Oops, sorry. But do you remember that we have, oops, yes, you do, or no, you don't. But when we are talking about the present, if you remember, when it comes to he, we have yes, he, what do I put here, guys? ¿Cómo sería esto? Impresa. Yeah. Does. Perfect. Yes, he does. Or. No. He doesn't. He doesn't. Excellent. No, he doesn't. So that means that in present, it changes a little bit. Okay? But when we are talking about the simple past, it is different. Why? Because this, all this, remember, all this is present, the short answer. But when we talk using the past, we don't have that many problems. Why? Oh, because if you see, we get, yes, I did. No, I didn't. Yes, you did. Or, no, you didn't. But when it comes to he, she or it, when it comes to the third person, cuando viene ya la tercera persona, we don't have a problem because in past is exactly the same auxiliary. It doesn't change. Yes, he did. Or no, he didn't. Okay? So if you notice, it is very, very simple. In the past, there's no change as it is here. Here you can check out that there's a change. There's a difference. But when we are talking past, we don't have that problem. There's no change. So that means that if I have guys here, chi, yes, she did, or what would be here? No? No, she didn't. Exactly. As you see, it is very simple. And if we have, what about if we have they? Who can help me? Can I do that? Yes? They? They did. Exactly. They did. And the negative? No? No. They didn't. They didn't. They didn't. So Vanessa, was telling me that she had a problem with the with some of the co-workers. Tell me, Vanessa, did they fix the problem? I'm sorry, Jason. Did your co-workers fix the problem? Carlos. No, did you solve the problem with the, your co-workers? ¿Solucionó el problema? No. No. No, no I no, I didn't. Exactly. Very simple. Okay. Remember, no, I didn't. Can I go back? ¿Puedo salirme acá? Yes. Yes? Yes. Okay, perfect. So, did you see? It is very, very simple when we are talking about short answer, okay? Like, Sylvia, uh, do you work on Sundays? No, no, it isn't. No, I? Uh, no, I didn't. No, because 
listen, I'm not asking you about the past. I'm asking you a routine. If it okay. is a routine, I'm asking you about present. Do you work on Sundays? Le pregunté, ¿trabaja los domingos? And you answer to me? No, I don't. No, I don't. Okay, now listen, Silvia. Uh, did you did you wake up early last Sunday? No. Wake up? No, I didn't. No. Because it's no. the past. Thank you very much. Hilda, tell me, Hilda. Yes, teacher. Did you, did you prepare dinner today? Yes, I did. Excellent, thank you. And okay. did you have dinner already? Did you? Did you yes, have I dinner? did. Okay. Yes, my, fam my family, I, let me see. My family, they, they did. Okay, right. great. Okay. Remember, sometimes we are just talking about WH question, guys. Sometimes it is necessary to include a, we were talking just about yes, no question, but sometimes we have the problem that we need to include WH questions, and that's a little bit different because if you remember here, we were talking about just yes, no question, okay? So we have, yes, I do, no, I don't, yes, I did, no, I didn't, because the questions could be answered just with yes or not. Now, look at this question. What did you prepare for dinner? So tell me, Hilda, what did you prepare for dinner? I prepare. I prepared uh, to dinner and uh, uh, eggs, eggs fries, okay. beans. Um, only that and bread. I buy bread. And for the, the drinks, coffee and juice, orange juice. Okay. You said coffee and orange juice. juice. Okay. In this case, if you notice, guys, she's giving me a lot of information. Why? Because I use a WH question. Now, do you remember that WH questions, the rule for them is simple. They go always at the beginning. Do you remember that the structure for the questions in past was auxiliary did, subject, verb in present, and complement, and question mark, right? But when we are, when we want information, so it's not a yes, no question. When we have an information question, yes, you will give information. When they ask you what, where, when, you are supposed to provide information to give an answer. And remember, the yes, no questions are simply answered by yes, I do, no, I don't, yes, you, I'm sorry, in past, yes, I did, no, I didn't, yes, you did, no, you didn't, yes, he did, no, he didn't. But when we talk about the WH questions, information questions, you need to provide information. And if they ask you in past, usually you answer using past tense. Any question up to here? Alguna pregunta acá? En la respuesta, teacher, no, en la respuesta larga de WH question, este, no, no ponemos el did. In this case, because it's affirmative. In este caso, como es afirmativa la respuesta, I asked her, what did you prepare for dinner? And she said, oh, I prepare fried eggs, beans, bread, coffee, and orange juice. Because she was answering, ¿qué? ¿Qué preparó? 
So she used mm -hmm. the verb in past. But imagine that she didn't cook. Imagínese que ella no cocinó. She could tell me, oh, I did not prepare dinner today. You see? Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. It's because the answer is a negative. Mm -hmm. But as I am asking for information, she's giving me information, even if it's a negative sentence. I do mm -hmm. not. If you notice here, we have prepared because it's affirmative. This is an affirmative sentence. I prepare fried eggs. That's affirmative. In this case, okay. it is I did not prepare my dinner today. And imagine that she's like uh, that Hilda is very tricky. Imagínese que Hilda no hace trampa. And she asks me, what? Do you think I prepare? She can ask me back. Yo le pregunto, ¿qué preparó para la cena? Y ella me dice, ¿qué cree usted que preparé? What do you think I prepare? In this case, is present. Why? Because she's asking me about what do I think in this moment. Mm -hmm. Okay. So, okay. depending on the answer, you are going to use the did, the did not, or the verb in past. Okay? Okay. Any question okay. up to here? ¿Alguna preguntita? Mm, teacher. Yes. Uh, for example, uh, the question is, what, what, uh, I'm sorry, the uh, other answer of, uh, yes, I did prepare, is valida. No, because okay. I asked her, what did you prepare? Yo le pregunté, ¿qué preparó? Mm -hmm. So in this case, she tells me, or she got just two options. Ella tiene dos opciones. She tells me what she prepared, and she tells me, no, I didn't prepare nothing. Okay? Okay, teacher. Yes, thank you. You're welcome. Any other question? ¿Hay otra pregunta? No? We clear? Right, excellent, excellent. That means that we are ready to do the first exercise. Do you remember you have homework? We are going to divide right now and you are going to tell to your classmates your five negative sentences, okay? Teacher. Yes, Hilda? I have a problem. <laughs> tell me, tell me, tell me. Because I lost the homework note for tomorrow. Oh, so, so sorry. <laughs> but don't worry. You can go to the breakout room and tell to your classmate two or three things you did not do today. Okay. Simple. Okay. Remember, these are five negative sentences what you are going to tell your classmates. Okay? So. Okay. Do it. Let's start, guys. Jump in. Angelica, can you get into the group? Hi. Hello, Vanessa. There's Angelica. Um, I didn't wash the dishes in the morning. Oh, come on, Roxana. Why? <laughs> Why didn't you wash the dishes? Um, it's an example. Ah, okay. It's just an example. Yes. It's, not, it's not real. No, not real. Oh, okay. Yeah, I was worried. I was like, oh, come on. <laughs> continue, guys. Continue. Okay. I didn't brush my teeth after the breakfast. Uh 
Uh -huh, guys, why are you so quiet? I think Hilda. Uh, okay. Hi, Hilda. I, I am uh, sorry. I have a problem with my my speaker, but I'm here. Okay. That's okay. great. That's great. That's great, Hilda. But you can be here ready. Yes, I'm ready. Okay, okay Hilda, tell me. The few uh, negative sentences. Yes. Past. Yes, please. Okay. Eh, the same the vamos a, a responder lo que estaba diciendo mm. Spanish come on I got you I got you remember <laughs> just say things in negative okay negative sentences you can tell them about yourself like let me see I didn't Hmm, what didn't I do today? I uh, imagine that I can tell you, oh, I didn't take a shower today. Oh my gosh. <laughs> okay. okay. Something like that. Uh, I didn't I didn't have dinner yet. I didn't have dinner, so I'm going to eat until 10. Okay? Simple. Continue. Okay. Thank you, sir. Por así decirlo, he speak. Teacher. Yes. Teacher. Dice, my, my first question impress, uh, impression is yes. I brush, no, in past, ¿verdad? Uh, I brush, I brush my teeth. I brush my teeth. I brush my teeth. The interrogative, did you brush, did you brush his teeth? Así. His teeth. His teeth, ajá. Uh -huh. A él. Estudiantes. Your, 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 your. Ah. Yes, but right now I'm not just asking you, Vanessa, to tell your classmate the negative. Okay. Like, yes, like look, look at me. Like if I tell you, oh, I didn't, I didn't take a shower today. Thinking. Mm -hmm. uh, I didn't, uh, I didn't cook today. I didn't drink coffee in the afternoon. You mm -hmm. see? Just negatives. Mm -hmm. Only negative. But... Yes. I didn't I didn't exercise yes. today. Okay. I didn't exercise today. Perfect. I didn't exercise. Me cuesta eso pronunciar. Exercise. No, no, no. Exercise. I didn't exercise today. Exactly like that. Okay, guys, two minutes and we are going back, okay? Okay. Y verdad que esta mina ahí vamos a hacer. My dear ladies, did you finish? Yes, yes. teacher. So you are ready? Yes. Mm -hmm. Okay, great, great, great. I'm going to tell everybody that in 60 seconds we go back. Okay. okay. Okay, we are just waiting for everybody to come back. There's just 30 seconds for them to be back here. And we're going to do the exercise. And after that, we are going to work with something else. We're going to be working with vocabulary, new vocabulary for today, actually. So let's see, there's Francisco. Okay, hello, who's teacher. missing? Hello, Francisco. There's, mm, 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 mm. we are missing Rubidia, Silvia, Angelica, and Marina. Okay, they're coming back. Okay, let's see. Francisco, tell me, who do you work with? I work with Hilda. Hilda, tell me about Hilda. Okay, Hilda, this day she didn't cook for lunch. She didn't cook lunch, Hilda. Come on, what happened? What happened? 
She didn't cook for lunch. She didn't cook dinner. Oh, no, she did dinner for her. No, dinner, dinner, yes, I did. Okay. Lunch. Okay, okay. By the lunch. Very busy teacher. Okay, I can imagine. Something else about Ilda Francisco? Uh, she didn't exercise this day. Oh, come on, Ilda. No lunch, no exercise. What happened today? Only sleep. <laughs> Only sleeping. Come on, come on. Thank you, Francisco. And, and watch, and watch, and watch it. And Netflix. Okay. Oh, really good. so you were watching Netflix all day long. Shame on you. <laughs> Ilda, look at this phrase in the chat. Shame on you. Qué pena. Shame on you. Oh, yes. Shame on you. Okay, okay. Thank you. Now, Hilda, tell me about Francisco, please. I want to hear negative stuff about Francisco. Tell me. Okay. Francisco, he did not drive your, uh, his car. Okay. Francisco... Uh, did not? Did not cook uh, you, his, his lunch. Okay, either nobody had lunch here today. Francisco it did not. Um, I remember. Ah, uh, wake, wake up early. Okay, thank you very much, Hilda. That's perfect. Okay. Sylvia, hello, Sylvia. Hello, teacher. Sylvia, who did you work with? Uh, I worked. Uh, uh, listen, listen, listen. I worked. I worked through video. Okay, tell me about Rubidia, please. Uh, she, Rubidia, she did play volleyball today. She didn't play volleyball today. Hmm. Yes. Uh, she did not meet at work. Okay, she didn't. She didn't uh, meet a work. Perfect. Okay. Excellent. Thank you very much, Sylvia. Thank you. Rubidia, tell me about Sylvia, please. Hello. Hello. Uh, Sylvia, he mm -hmm. did not Sylvia watch. Sylvia didn't. Sylvia didn't not watch his oh, care. Okay. If we say didn't, we are contracted did not. So, cuando decimos didn't, estamos contractando el did con el not. Okay? okay. So, you just, you don't say did, didn't not. We say didn't. Okay? Okay. Sylvia didn't watch his hair. Oh, really? Yes. Mm -hmm. <laughs> Interesting. Well, I, I heard that ladies do that. He escuchado que las chicas hacen eso. That's different. Okay, tell me something more about Sylvia. Yeah. Rovidia, another yeah. sentence about Sylvia? Algo más de Sylvia? Um, no recuerdo cuál Okay, otra vez. no problem, no problem, no problem. <laughs> Thank you very much. Angelica, okay. tell me one thing about Vanessa, please. Vanessa, ay no, se acuerda que conmigo trabajo. <laughs> hello, hello. Okay, who do you work Vanessa, with? Vanessa, Vanessa. Angelica. She. Okay, yes. She didn't clean her desk. Oh my gosh, Vanessa, come on. Y, Hilda didn't cook. She, Silvia didn't wash her hair. Vanessa didn't clean y her Vanessa, desk. Vanessa. Everybody is Vanessa today. Eh, y Vanessa and didn't Vanessa. clean. Eh, ah, what? And Vanessa. And Vanessa didn't clean. Clean what? No me acuerdo. Me dijo no, she no, didn't no, clean. No, no. And Vanessa, she di, didn't walk in the morning. Okay. And Vanessa, she didn't check email. 
Okay, she didn't check her emails either. Wow, Vanessa, you didn't work today. Come on. sleeping today. <laughs> yeah, she was wasting her time all day long. Jesus, I thought just Ilda <laughs> didn't do nothing. Well, thank you, ladies. Uh, Vanessa, tell me about Angelica, please. Uh, Angelica, uh, she didn't exercise today. Oh, my gosh. Uh, she didn't cook. Ooh. And she didn't drive a car. Okay, okay. Very interesting. Thank you very much, Vanessa. Thank you. Who's missing? Who's missing? Who's missing? Mm, Roxana? Hello. <laughs> Hello, Roxana, you are missing. Yes. Tell me about Vicky. Um, she didn't brush her teeth. Mm -hmm. um, and she didn't clean her desk. Okay, either. Oh my gosh. She didn't check her email. Perfect. And she didn't organize meetings. Okay, very interesting. Thank you, Roxana. So, Vicky, Roxana is talking about things about you. Tell me about her. Yes, teacher. Um, she didn't wash the dishes in the morning. Aha! Tell me more. She didn't brush her teeth after breakfast. Oh my gosh. She didn't play her daughter. She didn't play with her daughter. With her daughter. And she didn't watch TV. Okay, well, thank you very much. Excellent, guys. Uh, the, the objective of this exercise was for you to use the negative and for me to, to check if you are structuring the sentences in the correct form. And I am glad to say that you did. Okay, so you understand that the objective of this activity was for me to check if you are using the structure in the appropriate form. So today we have worked with the affirmative, with the negative. We have make, I have made some questions to you. You have answered, you have shared negative questions. And as a second part of the class, we are going to work with vocabulary, okay? There are like uh, summer, summer activities, okay? So, let's see, let's see. Tell me, Vanessa, do you like meeting new people? Uh, yes, I like. Uh, I'm sorry, uh, meeting, uh, reunirse, ¿verdad? In this case, in this case, as I'm talking about new people, the question is, do you like meeting new people? That means somebody what you don't said. know. Yes, exactly. Okay. Exactly. Do you like meeting new people? Yes. Yes, I okay. like. Okay. What's the type of people you like? Um, the people same. Uh, um, I don't know. <laughs> okay, okay, another question. Don't worry, don't worry. Tell me, Vanessa, uh, what are some activities you like to do on your free time? Mm, you are on vacation and it is summer. Imagínate que está de vacaciones y es verano. What activities would you like to do? I like listening to music. Listening uh, to music? Listening to music. I walk. 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 Uh, on the street, uh, caminar <coughs> en la calle, o caminar donde sea. Yeah. Um, I, I like watch TV. To watch TV, perfect. Watch TV. I, I, um, I what like... What about picnics? Do you like picnics? Um, picnic, no, 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 I don't like. So you don't like going on a picnic? No. <laughs> Why not? Because, uh, how do you say it's mosquitos? No sé. Oh. <laughs> yeah, the mosquitoes. And, and I prepare the, 
the food, uh, oh. the bread. So no, I don't like. Not, for you, it's not relaxing. No, no, I don't okay. like. Okay, thank you very much, Vanessa. Thank you. Francisco. Hello, Francisco. Hello, teacher. Tell me, Francisco, do you like hiking? Uh, I'm sorry, repeat. Do you like hiking? Look in oh, the chat, uh, the word, hiking. Do you know what is hiking? No, I don't know, teacher. Hiking uh, on a mountain. Really, no, teacher. I don't practice. You don't practice that? No. And what about swimming? Do you like swimming? Yes, I like. Oh, really? Yes. Okay. Yes. Where do you like to swim? Do you like to swim on rivers, on a swimming pool, or in the ocean? I prefer swimming in the pool because the ocean is very dangerous. And okay. the late, uh, really, I get scared. Oh, really? You get scared? Yes, because it's dangerous too. Okay, yeah, I understand you. Okay, tell me, do you think you are a good swimmer? Really, no. Average? Yes. Okay, okay, that's perfect, excellent. Now, let's see. Thank you very much, Francisco. Okay, Hilda, hello, Hilda. Hello, teacher. I'm sorry, but I have a problem with my audio, but I don't know what we have to hear. Can you hear me now? Yes, yes. Okay. Yes. Tell me, Hilda, uh, do, you, do you have many old friends? May I repeat, please. Do you have many old friends? Yes. Okay. Yes. And do you like meeting with all friends? One. Yes. The, for example, I'm meeting for my 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 friends the primary. Oh really? Yes. Yes. Wow. The, yes. Mm -hmm. But you say primary school. Primary. 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 Oh, really? That's nice. So you remember your friends from high school? Yes. yes okay. Yes. What activities do you like to do when you meet them? What, what, do you, what, what do you like to do when you meet with your old friends? Uh, uh, it's, it's, I speak a lot. The, many, many things happen. Okay. Um, um, because I feel happy. Okay, that's nice. That's very nice. Yes, yeah, okay, that. Thank you very much, Hilda. Sylvia. Hi, teacher. Tell me, Sylvia. Sylvia looks tired today. <laughs> Tell me, Sylvia. Uh, when you have free time, uh, do you like watching movies? Uh, yes, I like... What's your favorite uh, type of movies? My favorite movie is... Um, Son Como Niños. Okay, so you like comedy? Yes. <laughs> okay, that's interesting. Yes, because um, I was asking you what some is... Some movies. A favorite. 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 Uh, okay. Um, a movie I favorite is um. ¿Cómo se llama el perrito? Bailey. Bailey. Alright. Por la razón de estar contigo, o la razón de estar contigo, algo así. I'm sorry, I, I don't know that movie. This. Perhaps it's not my <laughs> type of movie. But that's what you like to do when you have free time. Excellent. Thank you very much. <laughs> Roxana. Hello, Roxana. Hello, teacher. Okay, Roxana. Do you like practicing sport? Eh, no, I don't practice any sport. <laughs> what about when you were younger? Did you practice any sport? Yes, I... I, I practice, practice, uh, practice. I practice uh, uh, swim, swimming, swimming and running. Oh, really? Running. Running, yes. 
Oh, that's nice. I like it. Yes, I like it. But now I don't have I don't have time because of your obligations. Yes, for my work, for my daughter. Yeah. Okay, I understand. I can understand that. Thank you very much, Roxana. Mm -hmm. Rubidia. Hello, teacher. Hello, Rubidia. Tell me, Rubidia, uh, what do you do for fun? When you want when you want to have fun, what do you do? Repeat, teacher. What do you do? Okay, I will write the question. What do you do when oops when you want to have some fun what do you do when you want to have some fun que hace cuando quiere divertirse uh, play soccer okay oh you like play My soccer paper. Really? Yeah. What else? What else? Tell me more activities you like to do. Uh, I, I play, I play basketball. Basketball also? Wow. Yeah. yeah. Oh, you, I, like, you really like sports? Yes. Good. Yes. Excellent. Yes, yes, yes. I, I like it. Swimming. Oh, great. Yes. So tell me, what is your position when you play soccer? Do you like to work as a, to play as a defense, as a midfielder, as a forward? What? When you play soccer, what is your position? Oops, I think she's having problems with position. the audio. Okay. Uh... Okay. Sorry, Rubidia. I think we are having problems with the connection. I couldn't hear you. Okay, let's see. Vicky. Hello, Vicky. Hello, teacher. How are you, Vicky? Fine. Fine? Yes. Okay, Vicky. Imagine that I want to... In we are friends and I want to invite you and your family to watch a movie. What type of movie would you like to see? Um... Romantic movies. Romantic movies. Ooh. And comedy. Comedy. Okay. Comedy. Tell me, who's your favorite actor? Um, I don't remember. I don't remember. I don't remember the name. Okay. Oh, uh, Julio. Mm. Cool. Uh, a, a Italian actor. I, an Italian actor. Mm, that's yes. interesting. That's mm -hmm. very, very interesting. Let's and Lee Min Ho, a Korean actor. You got me Two. with both of them. Perhaps it's a different type of movies that you like to see. Thank you very much, Vicky. Okay. Okay, now let's see. Marina, tell me, Marina, how do you like to be called, Marina or Vanessa? Eh, eh, Vanessa. Vanessa, okay, thank but you. But it's the first name, Marina. Yeah, okay, Vanessa, <laughs> tell, me, tell me, Vanessa, eh, do you like reading? Yes. Okay, what type of books do you read? Eh, actually, I read eh, the book, the, the name book, uh, ay, um, El Mundo de Sofía. Oh, really? What is it about? Uh, it's about... Um, I tell of a magic world. No. <laughs> uh, it's about the child, the, the life of the child. Okay. okay. That's interesting. Uh, it's about uh, philosophy. Is is oh, uh, really? is is a course 
¿cómo se dice? Es un curso de filosofía en un libro. It's, it's a course of philosophy in a book. Uh, yes. Oh, that's very interesting. But what's the type of books you like to read? Or are those the type of books you like to read? Mm, I like uh, about uh, posit positive. Oh, motivational. Motivation and the about history. Oh, really? Yes. Very interesting. Very, very interesting. Well, in, in my case, I share the same passion with you. I love reading. History, I love reading history, but mostly about uh, French Revolution. That's my favorite. French Revolution, okay, okay. Well, thank you, Vanessa. And, and love. Yes. Oh. In love. <laughs> but don't tell me Jane Austen. I hate Jane Austen. Uh, <laughs> no, well, I can pass Jane Austen. I don't, I cannot pass uh, Daniel Steele. <laughs> If you give me a book of Daniel Steele, I get like, oh, no, I hate it. Thank you, Vanessa. Thank you. You're welcome. Okay, guys. What we have been doing right now is that we've been practicing vocabulary related to activities we do for fun, like perhaps when we are on vacation or perhaps when we uh, have some free time. Now, remember, if you got, if you have an activity, that activity is a verb, but If you have the verb go, after that verb, you write another verb in ing form. Like, uh, let's go, imagine that I say, hey, Sylvia, let's go dancing tonight. I am inviting her to dance, but I tell her, let's go dancing. Okay? If I have a verb, another verb after the verb go, that verb, in ing form okay let's go dancing let's go let's go swimming this weekend see after the verb go comes another verb with ing form okay any question guys Not i hope you Not have enjoyed your class because yes the time run now Okay, remember, this is the last class of this week. I will see you on Monday, but work in the platform, please, very please. And if you have any questions, don't hesitate. You can contact me, okay? If you have any doubt with your sentences, your negative or your interrogative sentence, you can send them to me and I can help you check in them, okay? Okay. Bye-bye. Take care. Bye, Bye. Bye. teacher. Bye. Bye. Good night. Have a good night. Good night, good night teacher. <laughs> the evening. Hey, we're the same as Sylvia. Bye. Oh, bye, teacher.